Hello everyone and welcome back to my Destiny Reaction series. Today we're watching the last part of The Red War and I don't want to waste any time because I want to know how this ends. So let's get right into it. Tell me again, Speaker. What makes your guardians worthy of the light? What is the price of such power and immortality? Devotion. Self-sacrifice. Death. 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 Explain. Devotion inspires bravery. Bravery inspires sacrifice. Sacrifice leads to death. So, okay. feel free to kill yourself. <laughs> Devotion. Sacrifice. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was fire. Dude, that was so good. I was born an outcast. A runt. As is custom with the Cabal, I was cast aside and left for dead. Is he giving us a sob story? I was taken in by an old scholar himself disgraced, who saw in me something redeemable. He raised me, taught me, trained me. To be a psychopath. And in return, I would become a vehicle for his revenge against an empire that failed him, that failed itself. Rejection, ridicule, torment. It made me stronger. I gave everything to win, not just acceptance, but glory. Beneath my mask, Speaker, is the face of devotion and sacrifice. I will not take the light by force. To do so would be to admit failure. Hmm. And I never fail. Now, do you see why I will be chosen? That's really interesting, I actually. See now. Oh, hit him. Hit I him. see all that you have done. Our operation on the Jovian moon was a success. Once the cage is complete, we will have everything we need to begin the process of extracting the light. The cage? Dominus, everything we've worked for is here, for the taking. All that remains is your word. No. Huh. This is not the way, old friend. Wait, but what? But it is the way. The only way. Not for me. Wait, what? That's so interesting. Honorable Gaul? He literally just said he wasn't going to take it by force. And I guess caging it and extracting light would be taking it by force. So he's like, nah, new plans. Interesting. Okay. So really what you're saying is we're damned if we do, damned if we don't. On the contrary, now that we are together again, we just might stand a chance. The fact is, if we destroy that weapon, we will ignite a chain reaction that could send our son into a supernova. Yeah. Well, <laughs> nice at least we have each other. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> we all know what needs to be done. The Traveler must be freed. I'm thinking the three of us and a big fat pile of explosives can get the job done. Look. I still have that Vex teleporter. It's got a limited range, so we'll have to get a little too close for comfort. Then we get inside the city walls for it to be effective. But without mm. the light, an outright assault on the wall is doomed to fail. We could... There yeah. will be no coming back. Yeah. It's worth it. Wow. How do so we get in? You know, the city wall is kind of like this barn. Plenty of places to slip in unseen. So long as you know how. So she's not bitter that we left? She you're sure you're not help? one of my hunters? <laughs> not really into capes. Clearly. Nice poncho. <laughs> you need to get your team into the city without raising any alarms. My people and I can help you do that. 
We also happen to be pretty good at shooting bad guys. Hawthorne, it's one thing for us to put our lives on the line, but this doesn't have to be your fight. Yeah. You're not a... A guardian? You think you've cornered the market on sacrifice? You forget that we've had to survive without the light all our lives. Once upon a time, that big white ball in the sky was there for all of us. I think it's about time we return the favor, guardians or not. That's great speech and all, but let's not forget about the whole supernova and complete annihilation thingy. If yeah. we can't destroy the Almighty, we'll have to disable its weapon. And that means getting a certain guardian on board. We'll need a good disguise if we're going to fly right through a Cabal Armada. If it's a Cabal ship you need, there's a base nearby full of them. But it won't be easy sneaking in. Oh, we're done sneaking. If there's one thing I've learned from Cade, it's the value of a grand entrance. This is great. Anyone want a hug? <laughs> hugs? No? No hugs. <laughs> God, I love Cade. <laughs> he's, he's our delightful comedy relief. Soraya Hawthorne. I, dude, I love her. Like, when she was jilted that the Guardian was leaving, like, them defenseless, I totally understood where she was coming from because they never had a Guardian on their side before. Now they had a Guardian with the light again. Like, obviously she was upset. But now she's still throwing her hat in and being like, fuck it, we'll help you. Um, so, Soraya Hawthorne. We have a new plan. The Vanguard will lead a host of lightless Guardians on a counter-offensive -offen against the occupied city, hoping to free the Traveler. Meanwhile, you must disable the Almighty's sun-killing superweapon before it can destroy the entire solar system. To approach the Almighty undetected, steal the personal ship of Thumos the Unbroken, one of Gaul's chosen bloodguard. Bring the fight back to the Red Legion by completing mission Payback in the EDZ. Guardian, you've got a tough road ahead, so I'm sending in a holiday with something special. Oh? Whoa, More tanks? Whoa, whoa, whoa. How special are we talking here? So, Zavala, I gotta ask you something. When you told our guardian friend here, and I quote, I need Cade, did you by any chance happen to maybe cry? <laughs> Holiday, what's your status? <laughs> he just moved on. Let the record show, no denial. Still a couple quick Let the record show, no denial. This girl's heavy. <laughs> You might recognize this beauty from your near-death experience yes. in the arcology. You got us a tank? Uh, you got them a tank? Hell yeah. I never got a tank. You know you just break it. Guardian, holler my way if you need another one of these armored beauties. Plenty more where that came from. Oh, so I get nothing, and they get as many as they want. I see how it is. <laughs> Heads up, that carrier's spinning up its engines. You might want to pick up the pace. Oh, we got lock on? on? He has what you need to infiltrate the Almighty. Move. Oh, that's sick. Of course, the Red Legion have tanks too. Well, they've retracted the. Of course, they have to. They have a fucking star destroyer. Of course, they have tanks. Bitch. We're not going to be able to cross that gap. Oh, your super tank can't fly. Oh. <laughs> he's so jealous. That should give us a way across. <laughs> So, if it wasn't to give me a tank, why did you send our favorite guardian to find me? Your high risk, high reward combat maneuvers can be effective and inspirational. Inspirational? Well, yeah, but with a tank, they could be like a million times more inspirational. They're <laughs> almost out of the tunnels and coming up on the carrier. Good. The only thing standing between you and the Almighty is Thumos the Unbroken. He's a blood god. One of God is chosen. God. The Red Legion will die for him. Why don't you help them with that? Are they called the Red the Legion? Carrier. Are they called the Red Legion because they kill a lot and also a lot of blood comes from a lot, lot of killing? Did I just make that connection? Or do they just really Wait, like the color? see those generators? We need to take them out if we're going to board that carrier. One generator down. Shields down, but the ship's about to launch without us. Keep that carrier on the ground. Couple missiles up its tailpipe ought to do the job. The carrier's grounded. Now let's find Thumos. I wanted to watch it like 
full crash, but that would have been hard to animate. After this is over, I'll talk to Holiday about your tank. Oh, I missed you too, buddy. <laughs> Here we go. We're in the carrier. I hope Kate does Good. get a tank in a your later. Target is Thumos the Unbroken, one of all's moment. chosen. The key codes to his ship are your ticket to the Almighty. Hawthorne had a run-in with him while you were off planet. They're known as the Blood Guard for a reason. I tell you to be careful, but that didn't help the last team I sent out. You'll find the command deck, and you'll find Thumos the Unbroken. And you'll break him. Hell yeah. Careful out there. The team I lost to Thumos, they were good people. Some of my best. Our guardian can handle it, Hawthorne. It's what we do. It's what you did. Last I checked, without the light, you and me, not so different. Yeah. Oh, oh, the door is sealed. Look around. There's always another way in. Wish I could be out there with you. Pull the trigger myself. For my team. How are you? Your time will come, Hawthorne. I'm counting on it. We're almost to the hangar. By now, Thumos will know you're coming for him. Expect a welcoming party in there. Holiday, are you in range for an assist? Swinging back around. Gotta shake a couple of these red uglies off my tail first. Haha, <laughs> you better run! Don't leave the door open if you don't want me coming in! Is that Holiday floating by and shooting? All right, Guardian, That's so sick. I've done my part. Now go take care of Thumos for us. Got the key codes, and Thumos is dead. Check and check. Excellent work. Now get to the base, find his ship, and get to the Almighty. We're counting on you. You did a hell of a job, Guardian. I'm gonna spread the word. <laughs> Thumos, spread the, the Unbroken, has a ship in that base. It's the only way we can get you onto the Almighty undetected. So you're going to steal it. Oh, yeah. Newsflash, folks. The Fallen are on the move. Seems they didn't learn their lesson the first time. Those scavenging vultures, those fallen. Always turn up when you don't want them. Kind of like a warlock when you're... Hey. Go on. Nothing. Nope. Um, I'm done. <laughs> There's only one ship left on the landing pads. That must be Thuma's ship. Get to it before it's too late. The way's clear. Now let me at Thumos's ship. Great. This is the part where you borrow it. Forcefully borrow. So wait, Cover the me. I need to fallen are showing up to scavenge, works. so we're just missing the Protect hive, right? Ship. And maybe some of the taken. I don't hear dying. Still in one piece. Unlike someone I know, they can handle hostile technology. Hey, that teleporter was all vexy and stuff. <laughs> God damn it! Our plan relies on you. Destroy the Almighty's weapons. And the threat to our world. Hell yeah. While you're doing that, we'll get in position for the final run on the city. It's time for Gaul's last dance. Dude, I hope we get a chat with Gaul and he monologues. It kind of seemed like he was having a change of heart when the traveler didn't bless him Zavala's after everything he's been through. already getting into position around the city. But they can't attack until we shut this thing down. So. Ready oh. when you are, partner. Holy. That first cinematic we saw did not do the size of that thing we justice. We're on the Almighty. Good. You must find the ship's central core and disable its weapon system. Your best option will be to follow the fuel stream. Okay, I'm gonna say this like a million more times throughout this. The skyboxes in this game. I like every single time I look up or like the players looking up and I just soak it in. The skyboxes in this game are crazy. I will never stop complimenting it on that. That and the music. Are we too late? Not yet. You need to disconnect the link between the Almighty and the Sun before it disrupts the Sun's magnetic field. And everything goes boom. <laughs> Our forces are moving into position outside the city walls. Your signal will start the assault. We'll get the job done, Commander. That tunnel over there should lead us straight to the central core. Blocked. I bet we can get the grinders working and clear this. 
It looks like the Red Legion are using the planet Mercury as fuel. Strip mining the solar system? That's kind of impressive. Holy. Four tunnels are clear. So that's what it was doing to that planet that was behind it in that first scene that we saw it. It was like, I, I was wondering what the hell was happening. I guess it was like soaking it up as like raw we resources can the fuel to, to the power it. Core. Savala, your group is in position at the city's perimeter. Understood. Preparing to go radio silent. We can't give the Red Legion any warning. Yeah. So, the only way to get where we're going is... out there. Holy... Stay in the shadows. The shadows! It's time for me to go, Guardian. You know your path. God, you don't cool need our guidance anymore. If my journey ends today... Then I face it gladly. There's no hey, way. Hey, Hawthorne says we're reaching our insertion point, and I'm not big on goodbye scenes. So, you do what you gotta do. Make it out alive, okay? I need someone who gets my jokes. <laughs> See those tubes? Dude, I love him. That's I love him, Your Honor. The weapon core. Holy. Hang on, am I in max quality? Looks like the bitrate is struggling. Oh, I'm not in- Oh, I am, aren't I? Holy... There's too much beauty going on here. It's too fast. Holy crap, dude. What a sick scene. Interceptors. It's like they're begging us to blow this place up. Wow. That's... Wow. Yeah. The thermal exchangers. Take them out and the weapon will overheat. That's one! Temperature levels are rising, but it's not enough. We need to disrupt the core itself. A fusion cell. We'll use that to overload the electron reservoir. I'm bringing the ship around! Run! Holy heck. Escape sequence! Holiday, we need another bike. The weapon is destroyed. Start the attack. Look at the view, dude. Holy crap, man. We're done here. Let's go. Holy hell. That was sick. No, not the cock! Huh. That's a good job, Colonel. Colonel! <laughs> What's that now? Seven in a row? Yeah, who needs the light when you got a fine feathered friend by your side? Am I right? Am I right or am I right? I'm right. God damn it, dude. I love it. Yeah, get him! Get his ass! Colonel. Is that like a the play on the KFC joke? I hope not. That's dark for that little chicken. Okay. Yeah, that's the rally point where I'll set up the teleporter. Zavala and Akora should be at their marks by now. Zavala, we're in position. As are we. Akora, ready when you are. Copy. Fire in the hole. Dude, I'm kind of anxious. None of them have the light, right? Okay, let's go. Savala, we're coming around. Oh, 
Let's go, Hawthorne. What's with you guardians falling down all the time? <laughs> Where's Cade? If he's sticking to the plan... He's right where he needs to be. <laughs> now we just gotta get you and Ikora up there with him. Oh, barrier? Well, this changes things. I'll work on this. You need to get moving. Ikora, Cade is in place and I'm en route. Good luck. Guardian. Oh, the music at that with that timing? Dude, that was inspiring. <laughs> that was a cool moment, honestly. Can I just say, this feels like it's setting up for a moment for, like, Gaul to have an introspective moment and, like, sing about it. Like, if this was a musical. <laughs> he would dive straight into. Cool. The enemy attacks the city, and the Almighty is lost. Lost? Explain yourself. Laid waste by the very same Guardian that somehow managed to reclaim its power, and has been humiliating our forces throughout this cursed system. You would know this if you hadn't been wasting your time communing with a machine and the creature who claims to speak with Take it. Take care of your tone, Consul. My tone? We will fail in our mission to secure this power and deliver our people. For the first time in the glorious history of the Red Legion, fail because of you and your preoccupations. Look at your traveler, Dominus. The cage is complete. The time is now clear. That was the cage. Okay, okay. What is rightfully yours and take this power. Tell me, Speaker, what more does the Traveler want of me? Go. I speak for the Traveler. I never said it spoke to me. Huh. Huh. That didn't occur to me. Oh, his mask fell. This fixation is over. You have already been chosen, not by some inert machine, but by me. I chose you the day I found you. Remember who you are, what you are. This was the mentor that saved him being disgraced. You are Kamal. Okay. Kamal, wait for nothing. You will take the light. Do what you swore and give me the vengeance you promised. Look at me, student. Look at me. Holy... I will do what I swore, old friend. I am Gaul, and I will take the light. Holy crap. Will he take it by force? The Traveler? What's happening to it? Zavala, we're back and ready to... Oh. Another happy landing? <laughs> Guardian, are you still with us? We're fine, but the Traveler... That's why we're here. To stop this madness. Ikora and I are converging on the rally point. Cade's already there. We'll use the Vex teleporter to- 
That melodic music in the background? God. God, it's so Jump good. Jump to the Traveler. If we make it there alive. We've got your back. Welcome back, Guardian. Glad you could join the party. Red Legion's using these energy barriers to funnel us into kill boxes. I can hack into the grid and knock it down for short stretches. Stand by. We're through. Roger the music back. in the background is like setting this tone of like, like, seriousness but also hope with, with like i don't know i'm not i'm no music major but just with the way that it sounds just slightly uplifting it's kind of like not all hope is lost even though it looks bad okay is the teleporter active it's just the feeling that it Ow. gives yep almost ready i knew it never send a cage to do a hawthorne job heard that poncho hawthorne we're blocked again there's another energy barrier Hold on, I've got you. Go! Barrier won't stay down for long. Cade, we're seeing a squad of Red Legion flanking your position. What's your status? Damn it! Next time you get to fix the Vex tech while being shot at. Keep your head down, Cade. We're almost there. Ikora and I have reached the rally point, but Cade is still wrestling with a teleporter. I can either shoot or work on this thing, but not both, because they just shot off my arm. Oh, Kate. He's like robotic, right? Teleporter. It's okay. We can't <laughs> just get hold another one. Position much longer. The traveler. They're coming at us from all sides. We need your help, Guardian. Gaul found a way to drain its light. It's the only explanation, Guardian. We have to stop him. Mm -hmm. If he takes the light, it's over. Ikora, Kate. If we don't make it out of this alive, know that I've never been prouder to be part of your fire team. If we have to die, at least we'll die in the shadow of the Traveler, old friend. We're about to die and you're still making speeches? <laughs> one more. Hey! Don't shoot that! I love how Cade's the only one not getting sentimental. Guardian, we can't make the jump. It's all on you now. Save the Traveler! I'm kind of glad they're not coming in, because they have a better chance of survival out there. You're on Gaul's command ship. Just close to the Traveler's we can get you. Be brave. For all of us. There's the Traveler. We're getting close. Oh my god. Oh my god, that's so sick. It can't be. Holy. Fitting your traveler would send you to face me once more. Look upon me. Dominus of the Red Legion. Annihilator of sons! Razor of a thousand worlds! Slayer of gods and conqueror of the light! I am Gaul! Thomas and I have become legend. You won't escape me again! He didn't succeed, right? Traveler should have chosen me! And now it is too late! Look at your dead god! It won't save humanity a second time! I am gone! I claim! What I know I said I wanted a monologue, I didn't think it would happen like in the middle of battle. <laughs> Holy 
hell. Cool fight. Oh, here comes the monologue. So the light within him is skip. Biblically accurate angel? Is that gall? Traveler, do you see me now? I am immortal. What? A god. You have failed. Witness the dawning of a new That's so cool, dude. That's so cool. It broke free of its cage. Oh. If it was, I need to know what happened. If it was capable of doing that, why did it wait so long to do it? Let's let's just keep watching. Because it seemed like it fully broke free of its cage there, right? Or did it explode? And is it no more? Never a serious moment. Welcome aboard, Hawthorne. I love the moment when Zavala called her guardian. That was a beautiful moment. I'm the guardian! But they haven't shown the traveler, so I'm a little anxious. in all things you can block it even try to trap it but the light will find its way So it's alive, but really damaged. Wow. <laughs> so that's when it broke free of its chains. Was that the wreckage of Marasov's fleet? No, I think that's something else. Okay, I made myself sad for a second there, dude. Oh, okay, I think that's something else. Oh. Oh, it would be there. It would be right there in the ring. Wow. 
Wow, it reached far. I have concerns about how far it's reaching, in fact. What other horrible evil will feel that? This horrible evil. Okay, cool. Oh no, the pyramids! Wasn't that pyramid ship already floating? Make way, everybody! Hero, coming through! Maybe there's some <laughs> continuity problems with this recording. Uh, Sarai Hawthorne, we have witnessed the miraculous. The Traveler has reawakened, and Hawthorne has returned to the city. Zavala convinced her to continue her role as guide for both new and old guardians. She found her place in this new community, bridging the gap between humanity and the guardians who protect them. Wow. You better not let this whole saving the day thing go to your head, or I'm going to regret my decision. Yeah, that's right. Bet you thought you'd be rid of me by now. Hell no. Nope. I'm sticking around. Right on. Zavala convinced me. Can you believe it? We talked a lot about the clans I put together. He likes them. Thinks they'd be a good addition to the city. So, here I am. Still feels crazy to me, but these days, what's not? The Traveler is alive. Old rules don't apply anymore. But hey, never really liked rules to begin with. I never thought the Traveler would wake again. Ikora realized that the more we learn, the less we know. She now reflects on past events and meditates on the bright future promised by a reborn and living Traveler. She has also found in you a friend, someone she can trust. For her, that can be rare. Right on. If the Traveler was testing me, I think I failed. No. Being wrong is a new experience for me <laughs> but now i see that the mysteries of this universe are far deeper than i ever dreamed in the traveler's light whole new worlds of possibility unfurl before us for the first time in centuries i have no idea what the future holds hmm. isn't it exciting how you like my new setup Amanda Holiday is back in the hangar and doing what she loves most, tinkering and rebuilding ships and sparrows. She might not be a guardian, but she certainly left her mark on the Red War. Yes, she did. Sometimes I still look up and expect to see the old hangar. Ah, well. Ain't the first time I've had to start over. Forward momentum. It's a beautiful thing. I helped build these walls, you know. I was proud of them. I still am. But walls don't just keep out our enemies. They keep us Ooh. in. Uh, Zavala, I almost forgot to read this one. Zavala's design is so cool. Uh, Zavala carries upon his shoulders the burden of guilt for the loss of the city. The truth is, uh, the truth is, this was a wake-up call for all of humanity. It's time to shore up our defenses and take the fight to our enemies. It can be easy to forget that. In this... The start of our new golden age. The city is anywhere and everywhere humanity sets foot. We will venture outward. We will dare to behold the unknown. We will walk upon new planets. And one day, in the light of distant stars. And Guardian, you will lead the way. So we're explorers now? All right, Devin. What's next? Isn't there like only a tiny pocket that's safe in our universe to even explore? Helping me spread the word. We're broadcasting a signal from the farm to people who fled the city saying, you'll be safe here. And we need to make sure everyone everywhere can hear it. Place a few signal amplifiers around the area to boost the signal. That should do the trick. That's one note online. Looks like the signal's already amped. That was fast. Hang on a minute. I just spotted quite a few fallen headed your way. Keep your guard up. The music in this one is beautiful. Eliminating that captain under the church must have drawn the rest of the fallen out. They won't stop coming. We need to make sure that signal is strong. You better hurry up and place that second node. This place used to be so peaceful. This is the first time I've even seen any fallen since the Cabal hit us. Reminds me of a city. 
You all tried to make it so we never even laid eyes on a dreg. To keep us safe, right? There's another word for a place you're not allowed to leave. You know, with walls you can't see over, and guards everywhere. Uh, a prison! I read the boosted signal, and some kind of strange feedback. The Fallen are nothing if not persistent. I'd wager they have some kind of jamming devices nearby. I'm just saying, no walls at the farm. Come and go whenever you want. So let's make sure everyone can get there, eh, Guardian? Hmm. There. I've got a clear signal. No more feedback. Five by five here as well. Excellent work. It's nice to have a Guardian helping us normals for a change. But there's one- Us normals? Not the normies. <laughs> one more thing. Did I send those coordinates correctly? I've got them. Through the tunnel, across the river. That's the place. I left something behind there. We're almost to your coordinates, Hawthorne. Good. I left supplies there that I had to abandon in a hurry a while back. Supplies for the farm? For the city. But when you all got attacked, I dropped everything and flew across the ocean to try and help. Bad news, Hawthorne. The Fallen beat us here. The city sure doesn't need it anymore. We could use that stuff at the farm. All right, forget the supplies. Clear out those fallen, and we'll figure out our next move. Oh, there's so many explosives everywhere. <laughs> the area's clear. Not for long. The fallen don't like it when they're denied a good scavenge. They're bound to come at you in force. And do me another favor, you two. Drop another one of those node things to boost my signal, then get out of there. If you made them mad, you're doing something right. Don't let up. We did it. They're gone. You guardians really are something else. I guess I kind of forgot that. And now we know that there are resources to be found in the EDZ. Once we retake the city, that'll be a big help. Sure. What Soraya means to say is, thank you. Head back here when you can, you two. There's still quite a bit to do. Yellow. Kate speaking. Oh, hang on. Someone left a note here. EDZ Forest taken energy question mark. Red Legion Brian. Who's Brian? Who's Brian? Red Legion Scions. Guardian, we've heard disturbing reports from your area. They tell of Cabal with new powers. That sounds ominous. Yeah. We'll keep an eye out for any new powers? unusual psionic energy nearby. New powers? That scion. Is it shielding that centurion? Shielding? Then they are harnessing the energy of the Taken. But how? Red Legion scions are bad enough. But if they really have Taken powers. Since when did Cabal and Taken start sharing toys anyway? Yeah. We can figure out the connection later. For now, we must uncover the source of this energy. Are we going to see a new no Taken good. King? Taken energy readings are increasing. I bet it's spreading to science all over the area. If that's true, it could bring a plague of shadow beyond our imagining. Hi, Cora. You're freaking them out. Hi, <laughs> Cora, stop. It. You're scaring I'll me. location data from that centurion. But we have to go into the forest. You sure about that, buddy? Don't want to get, you know, eaten by a creepy taken shadow tree. <laughs> Cade, what exactly happened to you on Nessus? Um, this one is for the comment section. Do all the guardians have their light back? I think it was just sort of glossed over or perhaps I missed something. But I'm gonna assume yes, everyone has their light back who didn't have it previ previously, like Ikora, Cade's fellow, and so on. Um, they get eaten yet? I, no, maybe, they did not get. Maybe I didn't realize it. It got mentioned, but I don't remember hearing it yet. But use caution. We don't know what's waiting in that forest. My glimmers on something big and taken. That may be the safest bet you've made in years. <laughs> that portal oh, connects yeah. to the forest. The scions found a way to force it open. Well, it was nice knowing you, Cade. Did you see that? He got stunned when we took out his scion. 
Severing their bond must cause a backlash to the host. Interesting. Am I the only one who has no idea what any of you are talking about? No, I don't know either. Yes. <laughs> Kate, I'm with you. I have no idea what's happening. Hey, there are a lot more Cabal than I was expecting. Well, they may not like you trespassing in their secret magic fort. <laughs> Fair enough. Measured response? Taken. taken Cabal. Big Taken Cabal. A Colossus. Of course. You must destroy it. Holy. Trust the unequaled mall? Did it. They're all gone. Well, that'll set the Legion back a ways. Serves I feel like this player is geared to the teeth, or this content is not that hard because he just blew that boss up in like one ability question mark. I'm right, for messing with things they don't understand. Which is your area of expertise, after all. <laughs> Get his ass. As for you, Guardian, well done. If that brute had gotten loose with the Scions, there may have been no stopping it. Mm. And then I couldn't have collected on that bat. They can take it. Told you. <laughs> hey, you two. My scouts picked up a weird cabal signal coming from a ship that's definitely not Red Legion. Some new guy giving orders. He's got the Red Legion running around like errand boys on Nessus. Hmm. Last time the cabal had a management shakeup, they burned down our house. Yeah. Let's see what they're up to. Bring guns. Okay. Well, we always have at least three. <laughs> Because you get your your main weapon, secondary weapon, and then a special or like utility itself weapon. The confluxes, atmospheric, geologic, and tectonic data. They want it all. I'm not sure why. Okay, this might explain it. Let's see. The Legion is helping their unnamed leader identify mineral-rich deposits on Nessus for. Consumption. Consumption? Well, that can't be right. Is he eating shiny rocks? Did he get to drink the Vex milk? Okay, I'm going to read this and you pretend like I understand. The Cabal want to grind Nessus into glorious dust fit for royalty. They want to squish it into a diamond? It's no, no, more dust. environmental data. Dust. Just some logistical planning so they can prime their ship to eat the planet. This new Cabal leader might have a few screws loose. No, but isn't that literally what the Almighty did? That's not far off. Transmitting now. Cade, I'm picking up a planet-wide broadcast. Red Legion 7th Company has failed to- Is this a big ocean of Vex milk? It looks so sparkly and tasty. I want to drink the Vex, Vex milk, dude. Data. Their invitation to join the Loyalist regime is hereby rescinded. I feel like it There's would taste like, like Sprite, but like more fizzy and delicious. <laughs> The rest of you still have a chance to prove yourselves. I offer you a life of opulence. Opulence? opulence. Oh, I could go for some opulence right now. <laughs> I don't think Kate knows what I'm opulence in. means. This gets weirder. They've analyzed the planetoid soil and what might happen if it's combined with something called royal nectar. Royal nectar? One more Next cluster. <laughs> Great work. Both confluxes linked. Just keep them away while I read this recipe for converting Nessus soil into a purified royal wine? What are the Cabal doing? It's gotta be all code, right? I grabbed right? everything I could and shut down the confluxes. The Red Legion won't get any of the data this new leader wanted them to secure. They're gonna be so mad! I love it! <laughs> Serves them right. Let's get this to the Vanguard before I have to defrag. The Legion wanted every bite of data the Vex have on Nessus. Hmm. All I ask is you return to my loving embrace. Ew. <laughs> Emperor Callus has spoken. <laughs> Ooh, wait, Emperor? <laughs> As in Cabal, Emperor? What do you guys think it, it feels like to be hugged by a Cabal? I feel like it'd be too, like, sweaty okay, and I'll gross. later. Ikora now. Ikora? Uh, great job today, guys. Boy, he left in a hurry. I think it'd be I very smelly. That was a very smelly hug. What is that? They have braziers in space? What in the, like, Egyptian architecture? Like, what is the, not quite Egyptian. What the hell is this? It's very fancy. Looks like it has, like, some gold plating. 
Holy. This vessel will challenge you in ways you have never dreamed. Let's enjoy ourselves. Like a king's gauntlet? Ugh. Ugh. An embrace from this man would be very smelly. For sure, for sure. Is he friendly? Thirsty! Can I get you something to drink? Oh no, he's no, he's not friendly. No. Was he a robot? A Vex? Hold up. I'm very confusion. Was it a Vex robot leading the Cabal to exploring? Take it. No, the taken thing was something else. Okay, I'm getting confused. But it does look like Vex tech. If you seek the means to live to your potential, yeah. I can guide you to it. Yeah. There is power in this universe beyond your feeble light. Bro, what in the five nights of Freddy's? With those words and these parting gifts, take them and grow fat from strength. Take them. Emperor Callus. Outspoken. Everything you know is a lie. There is a truth. Bro, what in the Five Nights at Freddy's is Emperor Callus, dude? Truth beyond what your people and your speaker have told you. I can take you to that truth if you seek me out. These gifts are a reminder of my words. Ugh. Emperor Callus has spoken. Emperor Callus. It's just, is he alive? Is he dead? What is the, <laughs> the, the ammo popping out of him? <laughs> I don't know why that tickled me. <laughs> oh, dude. Okay. Okay. So that, that was the red war. Dude, that was so cool. Especially this section here, like with the lead up to the fight with Gaul and then Gaul literally turning into like goopy light and the traveler being reborn like so much happened in the base game of destiny 2 that sets up a lot of really cool things i'm really interested to to learn what's happening with with this five nights at freddy's abomination and see where the story goes from here because uh they kind of have a clean slate because gall's dealt with right i mean we still have the vex we still have the fallen we still have the hive all doing their own little things we have that person or what was it the mouth no the eye of savathun that popped out of a taken thing we still have that issue going on but yeah uh this was incredible uh i'm not too sure what expansion is next uh, like what i watch next but i'll look it up and uh get to it very very soon i can't wait if you enjoyed the video please leave a like uh consider subscribing if you want to follow the rest of my destiny journey and i'll catch you later bye